Timothy McElhaney Middle. Today is October 21st, 2020. I'm your co-host, Alex Kirchmar, and here with me today is my amazing, talented co-host. Oh, thanks, Alex. Nia Homer. We're here today to bring you, yet again, another bunkhouse report. Now, just like my shirt, we're ready for the Pledge of Allegiance with Kylie. Hey Colts, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Put your right hand over your heart. Ready, begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Kylie. Now here is Leah Hardy to give you today's birthday shout outs. Hey DMS, I'm Leah Hardy here on October 21st with today's birthdays. Happy birthday to Emma Cole, Sophia Cole, Sophia Hawkins, Shane Kelly, Jeremy Lowers, Sheldon Watts, and Naomi Weathers. Have a wonderful birthday. Thank you, Leah. Colts, it's college your day again. We want to see what college you guys are representing. So please, tag us at DMSASB. You can also DM us with you and your spirit gear. We would love to see our Colts representing college gear today. So please, wear your spirit gear. Colts, don't forget to keep six feet apart with your social distancing, wear a mask, and wash your hands at all times to slow the spread of COVID. And on that note, today is Wellness Wednesday, so let's go visit Miss Do. Hello, Colts. Welcome to another Wellness Wednesday. This week's topic is coping with conflict and problem solving. Conflict is a normal part of life. It can occur within your family, with siblings and parents, with friends, with teachers at school, and with society in general. Conflict does not need to be a negative experience. Instead, it can lead to some positive change. You can learn some healthy ways to manage and cope with conflict. These problem-solving strategies will allow you to stand up for yourself while still being respectful of others. After watching this short, funny video demonstrating some maybe not so great conflict management skills, please go to the DMMS Counseling Canvas tile on your Canvas page and click on SEL Lessons at the bottom of the page. Then click on the week link for Week 10, Problem Solving and Coping with Conflict. You will find different activities to complete to help you figure out your conflict management style, learn some rules for how to fight fair, and develop your problem solving skills. If you have any questions or need any support, please don't hesitate to reach out to your school counselor. Have a great day, Colt, and I'll see you next Wednesday.
Mr. Williams with some more news from the campfire and the rest of the story. I hope everybody's doing great this amazing Wednesday. It is cold gear day. Now, instead of me wearing my Harvard shirt, I decided to change my background. This is uh, just down the street from Harvard. This is Northeastern University, my alma mater, where I went. And as you can see, I have our logo up here to my right. And uh, Northeastern, heart of Boston, in the city. This uh, picture behind me is the quad. And we have our own quad on campus. So this is the quad that I had, went and hung out at when I was in college back in Boston many centuries ago. Uh, I want to talk about uh, College Gear Day. Maybe you don't have a shirt. Maybe you don't have a hat. This is actually Cal State Long Beach, just a little bit away from us. But you can change your background, participate that way. There's always a way to participate in a spirit day. You just got to sometimes think outside the box. We hope uh, everybody's been having a great week. Friday, Cold Gear Day. Let's see what you got for Cold Gear. Um, but we have uh, another broadcast program. It's called the Mac News. Let's check out what's going on with my friends over in the land of Mac News. Have you seen Mac News? 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 Are you watching Mac News? Mac News is our news program at DMMS. We work on bringing the news to you in a fun way. We cover topics like COVID updates, sports updates, how-to videos, and more. You can find them by looking at the DMMS website or by searching DMMS Mac News on YouTube. So please, check them out. Uh, have you seen Mac News? Wow, that was awesome. Have you seen Mac News? I have. It's a great episode this week, uh, as I mentioned the other day. And for everybody out there getting that new iOS 14 update or a new phone with iOS 14, check it out. A lot of good information there. Uh, this is Mr. Williams reminding you, have a little grace, have a little patience, and more importantly, have a great day. Leave it the way.